there is a Baylor football s staff change because Justin Johnson is now the wide receivers coach and assistant head coach at Texas Tech because there was an opening there. So he was at Baylor for the last three years as a running backs coach, uh, obviously part of that 2021 Big 12 title team, which I like to thank him for that, for getting them back for the first time since 2014. But prior to Baylor, he was at Houston for one year as a wide receivers coach, his alma mater. He, prior to that, even three years at Kansas as a wide receivers coach. Like, 2018, wide receivers coach, 2016, 2017, offense and analyst, grad assistant at Texas A&M in 2013. He was a offensive quality co control coach for Houston in 2012. He was a four-year letter winner at Houston from 2008 to 2011, including an all-conference USA first team pick in 2011, competed in three bowl games and two conference USA championship games. So that's explaining his background right there. Like as a senior there, he was he caught 87 passes for 1,229 yards and 12 touchdowns. Of course, he wanted to be a coach at his, the position that he won, he once played. So, we'll have to wait and see what Baylor does from here. I'm sure they got a few guys in mind already. They probably knew that this was coming. They probably knew. So, I would not panic. They're probably going to do a thorough search and look for a running backs coach. That's Of course, they have to be good recruiters or great recruiters besides develop the running backs and probably somebody that helps Joe Scrimes as well in terms of get that power back like le put your head forward I mean as in like don't get like stood up and then go backwards so we're gonna have to wait and see what happens with this new, who's gonna be that position now on the staff Anyways, if you like this content, hit the like and subscribe button. I see you guys later. This is going to be 500 subscribers. We're on the road to it. Let's go. And this is per on three on this report right here. So just an FYI. And they're reliable. 